today's video, we're going to be looking at Gradient AI, an online machine learning platform that makes it easy for users to build, train, and deploy models without using code. Without further ado, let's jump into it. Without further ado, man, we are on Gradient AI. In Gradient.ai, let's jump right into it. Again, this is an online machine learning platform, which will allow you to create, train, and deploy your own models, which is absolutely crazy. As we can see here, man, one platform, unlimited AI, customized and deploy AI systems from a single platform, private LLMs you own, which is absolutely crazy, man. Create your own large language model. Let me calm down a bit, man, because this is I'm hyped. It's a little too hyped right now. Fully unlocked models. Models are entirely yours to control. So you guys can go here, read all of this. I'm, that's not what I'm here to do, man. We're going to jump right into it, man. As you can see, we have already created an account. Workspaces for Kwame Glover. So we're going to go to our workspace that we already made, man. If you have not created any custom models, go to fine tuning to create and train one. That's what we're going to do, man. We are on fine tuning. So bam, man, as you can see, new model. To create and fine tune a new model, click on one of the base options below. We have Bloom, 560 million parameters. Llama 2, 7 billion parameters. We have a couple Llama 2 videos on this channel, so make sure you check those out. And then we have Hermes 2. We're going to go with what we're we are familiar with, man, Llama 2. And the model name is going to be Creator Quam. But playing with us, you already know, man. Advanced settings, we scroll down here, we are able to change the complexity of training tasks. Higher number equals more complexity. We're just going to leave that at default and we're going to create our fine tune model. So I've been sitting here for a good seven minutes, man, trying to upload a data set to Gradient AI. And this is the reason why I'm making this video, man, so you guys don't make the mistake. You have to upload a .json L file. Again, .json L file. If it is just a .json file, it will not work. Obviously, HTML files will not work regular javascript files will not work you need to upload your data set as a dot json l file so we have our data set right here is a piece of a data set oh and as you can see man our file is too big which is absolutely insane man we're gonna go back man I'm glad you guys can see these issues on camera, but we found another data set, proof file, underscore train, underscore 20.json L. The training data set is being uploaded, as you can see. So, as you can see, man, we upload our data set, and it is running right now. But, before we continue, man, let me show you guys how I even found this data set in the first place. We're going to go over to github.com, and I will leave this exact link in the description so you can find your own data set to train your model on but llm data hub awesome data sets for llm training as you can see man you just scroll down here and you have your pick of whatever data set you would like and you have a description of the data set which is absolutely insane once you pick your data set obviously you'll be brought over to huggingface.co and then you can download your files directly you have to note that gradient ai does have a max capacity of 800 megabytes of data as you can see, man, a lot of the data that is given to you for free is going to be over a one gigabyte or over the 800 megabyte level, which is, which kind of sucks, but you do have to do your research and uh, just do a little bit of work and finding a file that works for you. So with that being said, man, we have finally fine-tuned our large language model, and now we can test it out. As you can see here on the screen, man, it's taking me well over an hour of trials, man, to trying different models and just testing it out. It took me a few tries, as you can see here on the screen, it took me a few tries to finally get it working, but if we hit test right here as you can see man creator qualm gpt is here as you can see man creator qualm gpt is here and we can use it right here so we're gonna say and bam as you can see man our llm is talking to us it says hello it's nice to meet you is there something we can they can help me with so we just asked that a little financial question man we make $120,000 per year but we would like to buy a car that's $120,000 GTR Nishmo M4 CS 
That's how a nigga and we only have 45k saved up. Let's see if they can create a plan for us. And as you can see, creator clone GPT is going crazy, going nuts. Create a budget, start by tracking your income and expenses to see where your money is going. You do have to increase your income, cut expenses. So, basic answers to our question. Nothing too insane, man. I was hoping that they gave us a monetary breakdown of what to do with our money and how to actually invest it, save, etc. But this isn't too bad from creator clone. GPT. They do offer some suggestions such as a savings plan, a high yield savings account, try to avoid dipping into your savings for non essential purchases, monitor your progress. Bam! And by following these steps and staying committed to our plan, we should be able to save up for our GTR Nishma or M4 CLS. Looking over here at the settings, man, we are able to change the temperature, the top K, the top P. And then obviously, if we go back, we are able to fine tune our model again and then we can delete it if we're done with it. So, if you would like to get started right now with Gradient AI and create your own large language model, no more using ChatGPT, it's now Creator Prom GPT or UGPT. Without further ado, man, this is all you have to do Gradient AI, all the links will be in the description, so don't even worry about that. See, man, quick start, they give you a quick start breakdown, breakdown step by step of how to do this. As you can see, quick start models, LLM fine tuning, LLM interface, and this is just page one. You go to CLI quick start, and as you can see, it goes with way more in-depth on how to actually download everything and get things running so you can run your own large language model. They also have SDK Quick Start, which uses Python. This just takes you through all the steps, setting up your environment. It's installing Gradient Python, SDK, authentication, getting access to your token, finding your ID workspace, etc. Complete setup. As you can see, it goes through every single step that you will need to do this yourself. Also, if you have a question or just want to join a community of people with similar interests as you, you can go over to the discussions tab and you can see a lot of people are posting their questions and just their discussions. Without further ado, man, please check out Gradient AI. Thank you so much for, to Gradient AI for sponsoring this video, man. This is a small channel, so I'm very, very appreciative of that. Without further ado, man, please make sure you like the video, comment, and subscribe. And with that being said, man, I'm out. I just put a phone now, I'm sipping. I just put up two doughs, nigga, and they mixing. I just said, babe, you so different. But you been acting strange, LA, babe, you been distant. I've been on the road, I've been missing. But you know when I'm home on the stove, so I'll be in the I just put up clean, you know, and they next broke. She just gave me head, and you know that her neck broke. Are you asking me to cuff you when you neck broke? I've been feeling good, come green like a gecko. Knew you wanted to snag me from the get go. That's how a nigga get scoped And I just pulled up and I'm get uh, I just pulled up on that bitch like I'm get soaked I just told her to put her nose in it, come get coked Ayy, told her get wet, she could get soaked Told the nigga get in the Facebook, nigga get poked Told the bitch, yes we can, just to get votes Take a bad bitch to Tahoe, just to hit slopes I just told Brody, pass the hoe and let's get moped If she throw that ass this way, it's gon' get roped Ayy, nigga, and that's no joke